Hello everybody, I'm going to review the wood currently playing at the Donmar Warehouse and without a doubt the hottest ticket in town. Um, one of my friends um, kindly, or very luckily, not kindly, won the bailout and um, I was able to attend the very very first preview um, of this fantastic fantastic play. Um, so to give you a bit of a background, um, as always the Donmar is transport for this production and this time around they um, actually set it in a um, gym, in a school gym because um, they wanted to get it as close as to the real experience which is voting. <laughs> um, so they um, actually put in a voting booth, I think this is how you call it, um, and you get a little voting card and then you register yourself on stage, then you can vote your favorite party, put it into the box and just really adds to the whole experience and for me it was really exciting because it's the first time this year that I actually can vote in the UK <laughs> and obviously kip if you need them um, and this is done really really smartly um, the play itself it's done in real time outside the real time uh, it takes place on the 7th of May the day of the election uh, between half past 8 and 10 so the final um, 90 minutes before the closure of the vote and um, it's done really, really smartly. Um, the play was written by um, James Graham, which you might can see here, um, and he done this hilarious, absolutely hilarious comedy. Um, I thought it's starting like the first five, ten minutes. I didn't know if I'm going to enjoy it, but then afterwards, it was just a fantastic roller, hilarious roller coaster ride, and absolutely funny. I do really hope they bring it back and make it accessible to more people. Maybe in four more years when the next general election is going to happen, they could bring it back with even a different cast. Uh, the cast itself, oh my god, adds a cast of almost 50 people in a small, small, small Donma. Um, they have the whole show of British theatre. Everybody from Catherine Tate till, um, to Chuk, not uh, to Judy Dench, Hadley Fraser, uh, there are just so many fantastic names in it. Mark Gettys, who's brilliant in it. And there's a massive, massive list of like people who got me so excited as, as soon as I went on stage. Um, imagine it being like three lead players um, who um, kind of narrating um, what's happening on stage. And you have a lot of walk-ons um, and walk-ons could last everything from 5 minutes to 15 minutes like Judy Dench, she's on stage for whole 15 minutes and um, again, it's a fantastic cast every performer there on stage is an amazing actor in their own right um, so I don't know how they pulled off to get so many amazing names but very, very well done to the Don Mum um, then we're getting to the problem and how you actually can see it Tickets, um, it's completely sold out. Um, as I mentioned before, there was a bailout where you could enter, you could win um, tickets to see the show to buy it. And um, at the moment, what they have, they have very limited day seats available, which is standing um, in the circle at the Don the back. So it's quite okay um, to be there this, on the standing places. I've been there many, many times. Um, only problem is the day CQ apparently starts at half past four, even early in the morning. Um, so this is for a lot of people not an option. Um, funnily enough, what I would suggest is return tickets because it seems a lot of people booked those um, tickets without actually realizing that they have other commitments. So throughout the day it's very possible that you can get one of the um, cheapish return tickets um, which allows you to um, see this fantastic show. Um, if you can't make it a person, don't worry, it's going to be recorded for more for and will be aired on the live, which is going to be fantastic in a slightly cut version because they have to get advertising space in there. So you see actually more um, content, exclusive content in the Donmar. Um, on more 4 on the 7th of May, um, so you should really turn in if you don't get a chance to see this in person, but I do urge, urge everybody to make their bestest effort possible to see this fantastic show. and. Um, that's basically it. If you have any questions, leave me a comment. If you like what you see, please subscribe somewhere here. And um, 